a gamer, a consummate professional. Thank you very much. You want to Thank you. Yeah. All right. You know this guy. Yeah. We're going short. Oscar. Yeah. You promised me. Got up. First of all, I've seen the reviews about your performance, and I've seen the performance. One thing underrated: your physicality is amazing in this oh, movie. Thank you, sir. I'm thank sure you, you got sir. direction, but did they have to direct you on that, or was that nah, natural? Nah, in there, I say, I just hard work, brother. Hard work. I, 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 I was just, I was lifting heavy, lifting heavy weights, and uh, that was what the role called for. And there you go. I was in damn good shape for sure, and I needed to be. I tell you, I needed to be in every bit of shape I was in because it was a demand and it was an ask. You know? what, did, what did you make of Nate Diaz giving you a St. Patrick's Day shout? Love it, love Nate. Happy Paddy State to the Diaz bros and the Diaz clan. That's it, it's a man I shared I heard, 15 minutes in the octagon. Sorry, being stopped. I heard he's that, all right, he's all right, go on. I, just, I heard that you've got a return locked in, we're ready to go. Let's go, baby, summer, the max back. Tatiana. I heard you accidentally hit Jake in the face. Is I that true? One or two little wallops. What's, what's a fight between friends, eh? At the, at the lovely roadhouse. But he gave it, he gave it back too. Yeah, he gave it back too. He gave it back too. Jake's a consummate professional. Uh, he took it well and gave it right back. That's what you got to do. You got to get up and fight right back. You think he has what it takes to make it in the UFC? <laughs> For sure, he could, yes, for sure. I'd love to see him do it. I'd love to see him have a fight or two. Most certainly. Fighting is the most beautiful form of art there ever is. And, you know, it's a great thing to come into this game, which is also art. This is really beautiful. You know, Meryl Streep one time discredited my mixed martial arts in, 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 on, a, on a, I think it was in on one of the Oscars or certainly a, an award show. And I was real taken back because fighting is art. And it's, you know, it's brutal also, so I can understand, so, you know, so it's not for some people, but make no mistake, it's real artistry to be able to do what we do. So I came in with maybe a little chip on my shoulder and wanting to represent my sport and my art and, you know, give my best here in this, in this arena. And I feel I've done okay, I've done well. Yeah. The, the reviews are coming back well. Hey, you did great. I'm Thank you so much. much. Thank you. Hi. This Hello, is Elizabeth. You? Elizabeth. You saw it last night. You're amazing. Won't give away the ending, which was absolutely great. <laughs> You were brilliant at it. I saw it last night. So, I mean, yeah, so tell you me, so this is your first big fiction role. I mean, what yeah. was that like? Oh, it was amazing. It's so, so good. It's so, so good. So, you know, I, 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 got, I got to be, uh, uh, I got to be, I got to be around to amazing people. They're getting amazing. You know, he's an absolute star. Lucas as well, Billy Magnus, and then Jake Gyllenhaal. I was around amazing people on that set and friends for life. And then director Doug Lyman, producer Joe Silva. They guided me and helped me so much. And I was very, very, very lucky, very blessed. Very blessed. You know, but I'm not. I don't know what Gentlemen, together, this way, please. Okay, can you bring him down, please? Guys, look at left, guys, look at left. Right here, guys, right here, gentlemen. Take him down down here, down here. Right, 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 right. Okay, right there, right there. Gentlemen, together this way. Right here, right here. Right here, right here. Right here, right here. One last stop. 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 Right there, right there, right there. How are you, brother? How are you doing? I'm good, man. You look, you're looking well, as thank usual. You, thank you, thank you. When Connor enters in a world outside of fighting, right, you have to be along there for the ride. For the world of Hollywood and movies, I'm sure it's a little bit weird or a little bit more perverse, Hollywood as they call it. How has this journey been for you to experience watching Connor get into this world? Uh, it's been great. I mean, obviously, I always believed in his ability as, as an actor. He's an entertainer. He's a showman. We had a lot of opportunities come our way, and we said no. But the stars aligned for this one, obviously. Just the gruesome injury he had, had suffered in his last fight. Had a lot of time off. The script was good. Joel Silver, legendary producer, godfather of action films. Doug Lyman, the director. Jake Gyllenhaal is the lead. It's like everything just aligned so perfectly. And, for this to be our, our uh, theatrical debut in Hollywood, I think it was it was great, and uh, I'm excited. I'm excited for everybody to see it. It's funny. I, so I watched the movie in London, and I felt the one thing people haven't been talking about in reviews is Connor's like physicality on screen. Like he can be very funny just with his body and the way he carries himself. It's funny that you know 
from a world of fighting, he still has a knack to be an entertainer across the board. Yeah, I mean, he's just, he's a natural, right? I mean, obviously, we had also a lot of great guidance. We had a, our acting coach, Lana Georges, was on set with us. But even from a from a preparation, and Connor's such a perfectionist, he's so critical even now. He's like, oh man, I could have done better, I could have done this. But I was like, this is like your first fight. I mean, it's not like you were in the top form, your first mixed martial arts professional bout. So you got to take it in strides, watch the film, learn from it, take the reps, keep getting better. And, and, and I'm sure, I'm confident of it. He's going to be able to, to do wonders in this game. And not only, you know, action films, if you will, but to your point, I think he could do comedy, he could probably get serious. And it's all about just making sure that he understands and dives into the work, you know what I mean? Last one, it's a cliche question. Fight date, still looking at June 29th. What are we thinking? You're going to have an announcement real soon. Stay tuned. So, brother, I hope my you. finger didn't like find out. <laughs> no, you're being good. Yeah. All right. Hi, bub. Love it. What's going on, brother? You're not too much. How about yourself? I'm doing all right. I'm hanging there. I just wanted a quick question, really. Have you and Dana squashed the beef? Are you guys friends? What's the relationship like? He calls me a star fucker. So, I guess he's, uh, that was his last words to me. Instead of saying good luck, he called me a star fucker. So, uh, he said, I know you'll be out here trying to get all pictures with Jill and Hall and Connor and all them. And I said, you know what? I probably will. But, uh, not is there anything wrong with being a star fucker these days? Nah, you got to be in my game. We're not all billionaires, Dana, you know? Now, Dana's the, go the greatest guy I've ever met in my life. That's my mentor right there. It's funny because he talks shit on you, but I feel like he does it from a place of love, you know? I saw that podcast you guys did with oh, the... He came at me, brother. He came at me heavy. Yeah. yeah, heavy. He came at me. It was a good life lesson. He knew it. You know, the same talk that we had on that podcast is the exact same thing that we shoot the shit in real life. But he seems like a guy where if you fuck him off, he'll, like, never, like get you back on side again but you guys have mended those bridges he's pretty straightforward now we never burn a bridge i mean we always just talk shit never disrespectful you know he's the godfather he's the guy that has the upper hand so it's just, it's, how fun is it being in a movie very cool i mean when i was doing it it was like a long process of so many hours and shit but at the end of the day this is pretty fucking cool it's very good man congrats man i appreciate it brother i right. mean i love it I don't know if it. Gentlemen, together this way, please. Nice to meet you. How do you do? Okay, there we go. Yeah, can you bring them down, please? Come down, come down. Guys, look at left, guys, look at left. Right here, guys, right here, gentlemen. Down here, down here. Together, together. Right, 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 right,